Hello, this is Andrew Ford, and today we're going to be creating precipitation using CC Particle World and After Effects. Specifically, we'll be creating rainfall. We have an image of a castle here, and we have a black solid. We're going to highlight the solid and go to Effect, Simulation, CC Particle World. When the effect is applied, you'll see some particles emitting. We're going to raise the emitter to the top of the screen since rain falls downward, and I'm going to twirl open the settings of the effect here. First, we'll change the birth and death color to white. Then we're going to change the velocity under the physics portion to zero. This will make the particles go straight down as opposed to radiating out from the emitter. Since they're all stacked up, we're going to increase the radius X value under the producer tab to cover the screen. You can also adjust the Z or Y values as needed. Next, we'll bump up the birth rate, let's try 8, and the longevity, although longevity matters less here in rain because the particle should be off the screen in that time. So when we play this, as you can see, we have a ton of rain. Let's lessen it by lowering the opacity. Let's try 20% and see what we have. That looks better, but the rain's still falling too fast for my liking. So we can lower the gravity. Let's try 0.3. That's pretty good, but rain rarely falls straight down. So if we twirl down the gravity vector settings, we can change our gravity X value to give it an angle. And since this is shot with the camera looking upward, we can change the gravity Z value to match that perspective. Now we play it. This is looking a lot better. But I still think there's too much rain, so let's bump down the birth rate. Let's try six. And still a lot. We could change the opacity lower here, or something else we could do is just lower the opacity on the solid layer. Let's move the opacity to 50%, and now we have a pretty realistic look. Now keep in mind, you can add a wiggle expression here. You can change other settings in this effect to dial in even more realism. But this gives you a great look at how CC Particle World can be used to create rainfall. Thank you.